Hi everybody, it's Adam with heartvalvesurgery.com. We're here at the Mitral Conclave in New York City answering your questions that were submitted at our website. Thrilled to be here with Dr. Vinay Badwar, who is the director of the Center of Mitral Valve D Disease and Atrial Fibrillation at the University of Pittsburgh Medical Center. And we have a question, Dr. Badwar, that came in from Nupar Andrews, and she writes, is a palpitation a symptom of mitral valve disease. Uh, well, thanks, Adam, and thanks for uh, having me here. Uh, so, Nupar, uh, palpitations are very common in mitral valve disease, particularly in mitral valve prolapse. As you know from Adam's good work and your own research, mitral valve prolapse is an abnormality of excess tissue of the mitral valve, and when the tissues come together, one area can prolapse, uh, and particularly when palpitations exist and if shortness of breath accompanies the palpitations, it can be a sign, perhaps, of a flail or a rupture of the cord. And palpitations can commonly happen when there's exercise or when there's nothing else at all going on, and or if there's any other extra elements like caffeine, other things that can potentiate palpitations. It can usually be ventricular palpitations, or what's called premature ventricular contractions, or PVCs. You may have read about that. Um, and those uh, are different than atrial fibrillation. And that's two different types of palpitations. I guess I'd summarize the feeling, which is what you really care about, to define which side. Palpi PVCs are when you're feeling fine and your heart kind of pauses or skips a beat, and then a boom, and you, and you mm. kind of jump. That's a PVC, very likely. Atrial fibrillation is when your heart races and it flutters and it's not such a big bam. And that's just a subtle finding. Of course, this has to be proven with a monitor or an EKG to catch that. And of course, uh, if it is either, oftentimes with much valve repair, these feelings go away or improve markedly. Well, Nupar, I hope that helped you. I know it helped me. And Dr. Badwar, thanks for all the great work you're doing with our patients that are coming to you at the University of Pittsburgh Medical Center. Thanks so much for being here today. Pleasure being here.